Young Scholars Circle, our gifted prep process for the NNAT, the F Act, and the COGOT. Now, this is a quote that we like here at Young Scholar Circle. Poor test preparation and lack of test wiseness results in test scores that do not accurately reflect the student's knowledge and aptitude. Now let's look at test as a genre. So test taking is a genre and it requires a different approach. At Young Scholar Circle, we help your child to become familiar with the test content, the test format, and the test taking strategies that are similar to the difficulty level of the COGOT and the NNAT. These tests are timed, and it's important for students to solve the problems quickly and accurately. Filling out answer sheets is something new to students as well and may require exposure and or training. Let's look at tests as a genre. The contents of these tests is usually one or two grade levels above where your child currently is. The majority of the questions have not been taught in the regular classrooms at the time the test is taken. For instance, one of the contents of the COGOT is vocabulary knowledge. Vocabulary is not an overnight skill and it requires a lot of background knowledge on the child's part. We give strategies on how to enrich both the academic vocabulary by using them in both reading and writing contexts. Now the test format. Test format is something that children need to be exposed to. It, this may be the first time they're exposed to this type of test format. Also, they usually do not know how to transfer the format of the things that they learned in school to a test setting uh, because the two are very different. Now let's look at test language. Our goal is not only to prepare your child for the test but also to enrich their thinking skills. We use cognitive and thinking strategies to enhance thinking skills. We embed the use of background knowledge, mental images, synthesizing, monitoring, inferring, questioning, and determining the importance to understand the genre of tests and to think through the problems they are given. Instead of engaging in artificial and disconnected activities to cram for upcoming tests, students need to learn skills and strategies that will serve them throughout their school careers and beyond. Okay, so now let's take a look at our gifted prep process here at Young Scholar Circle. First, we'll take a look at the assessment. The first session is dedicated to an assessment and knowing your child's present level of skills their strengths and weaknesses. It serves as our guide in designing instructions for the rest of their sessions. And the length of the classes usually goes for three to six months, and that depends on your child's pacing and their starting point. Each month has four weekly, one-hour sessions. Skill development is a process, and it takes time to develop. Let's move on to feedback. Each session, your child will do a practice test similar to the one given during their exam at school. After the practice test, the teacher will go through the answers, specifically the incorrect responses. Students are encouraged to justify their answers. The result and performance of the students will be discussed to the parents after every session. Homework is also given to reinforce and review the skills learned in every lesson. Then we look at instruction. The teacher will analyze the items that your child has missed. She will identify the students' areas of strengths and their areas which need improvement to inform her of what to do in her future instruction. Her instruction will uniquely cater to your child's needs. The teacher will communicate to you uh, things you can do at home. She'll give you some topics to work on so when your child gets back to us the following week, prior skills that she taught are almost solid and she can move on uh, focusing on the next thing for instruction. And this cycle will repeat again. The last thing we want to make you aware of is there is something called a gifted behavior rating scale, which needs to be completed by parents. So what we do with all of our clients is have a gifted prep consultation. And in this consultation, we will give you tips and strategies on the gifted admissions process for Fairfax County Public Schools or Loudoun County Public Schools. Uh, we will guide you on filling out your gifted scale at that time. And thank you for watching our presentation on how we conduct our gifted test prep process here at Young Scholar Circle. Please contact us if you have any questions or if you would like to enroll your child in the program. Thank you.